Alrighty, hello again. This is BuzzM1, and I'm back with this Uncharted 3 playthrough on the normal difficulty. This is level 20 called Caravan. We're going to start this one out with the horse riding. Basically got to follow our new uh, comrade Salim over here. And he's going to he's gonna take us over to the convoy. We got to attack the convoy. That's the first thing. Uh, yeah, the first part's pretty easy. Just get you kind of in the in the swing of the in the riding, and you can aim your sight when you ride. You can also reload while you're on horseback. You can switch between weapons. You know, you can aim that one too if you want. Uh, but I'm gonna get the machine gun. I'm not sure if you can die on these parts really. If you try to go off track, um, Salim keeps keeps warning you like it's oh it's narrow, be careful and stuff. But yeah, there he goes. Careful, careful. But I'm not sure if you can really die. Alrighty, so we're going to get close to these guys and then uh, commence our attack. And there's guys in the trucks that are going to shoot out at us, and there's also little motorcycle guys that we can kind of blow up <laughs> while they're riding their motorcycles. It's kind of fun. We'll see what we can do here. Come on, we're nearly there. Come on. We're close, we're close. Uh, here we go. So Salim's going to go off to the right, and I'm going to stay on the left. And these first two trucks are our first two targets. Going to do a little stealth here. So you get on your horse and go to the back of the truck, jump on there, and grab him with the stealth. Bang, like that. Salim's got his man over there. Okay. I don't need anything. Here's my motorcycle person here. Yeah, you can just blow him up like that if you want. There's probably somebody behind me. Yes, no, no, yes. Okay, no. I'll get the ammo. We'll get back on uh, back on the horse, so to speak. Okay. Ooh, here's a guy right here. Okay. Let me reload. I gotta keep remembering to reload here. Aiming's a little tricky. Reload again. And like, if you want, you can get on the trucks and grab some more ammo. Usually, they have something for you up here. Um, see, these guys aren't out yet. They they kind of come out of their truck when you approach them. Ooh, here's a here's a friend right there. Grab a little more ammo. There's my horse. Wait for that horse to come, and then you can jump on it. All right, come on, horse. There we go. Okay, I've I've died on this before. Just just falling off the horse. <laughs> it's a little bit of a pain. Okay, here they come. Here, let me get this guy first. Oops, oops, oops. Watch out, watch out. Okay, got him there. He's still firing at me there. Okay, very nice, very nice. I'm going to see if I can get on the truck and heal up a little bit first. Because that was kind of a bad thing. I can grab some more ammo here. Okay, let's see. That's good enough, I guess. Alrighty, back on the horse, back on the horse. What can we do now? Okay, who's over here? Anybody? There he is. Got him there, I think. Okay. Reload. Okay. Ooh, there's just a, there's just a motorcycle riding itself. That's Casper. <laughs> okay, I gotta be careful here. I'll, I'll get killed. Get in the cover. Can I hit him? There's one of them. Okay, where's this truck here? Whoops. Where's my? There we go. There's your truck. Okay, my truck's on fire now. Where's my horse? Where's my horse? There he is. Okay, get out of the way of this exploding truck. Okay. Yeah, that was a close one. Alright, who's at me now? Got him there. Guy over here. Didn't sort out the first guy here. Ooh. It kind of auto aims. It's a little bit weird. Okay, that guy's out. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I guess I'm out of my machine gun ammo. Okay, here's a little cutscene where uh, Nate gets knocked off and then he gets saved again. This is like the comical part where this guy gets run over. Oh, just when you thought Nate was done for. <laughs> Roadkill. Roadkill. Come on! Give me 
Okay, back on the horse. And I, I don't think, yeah, I can't control the horse now, but Nate can still aim if he wants to. And I'm out of ammo there, so I gotta, gotta be careful. Gotta be a little more. Let's see, let's see. I got one guy there. Okay, jump on the horse, jump on the horse. Okay. What else do we got here? Wish I had more ammo. Maybe there's something in this truck here that I can grab. Let's see. Right, give me something. Give me something. I got a 19 on that one. Okay. Okay. Where is my horse? Oh, no. That, those are my friends now. Okay. Let's see if I can find. Here he is. No, that's not him. I don't know where my horse went. Oh, there he is. He's way up there. What's he doing up there? Okay. Get on him like that. Can I do it? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, he's got a mind of his own, that horse. He'll just wander off sometimes, so you got to be... Uh... Okay, that's good. We got him. Ooh. Okay. That guy. What else do we got here? Okay, so now we're getting close to our Sully rescue part. Okay, he's asking. Oh, there's a stray horse. So this horse, Sully's gonna get on one of these horses here. Okay, there's a part where this guy. Okay, here it is. Here's a cutscene where this guy's gonna come out. <laughs> There's Sully, okay. I don't think you can hit that guy. Sully's got to grab him. And uh, then I'm going to have to go help Sully deal with deal with this guy hiding in the trailer on the crane over here. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to jump up here. Onto here. There we go. Okay. We're going to get Sully situated here, and then we gotta we got to work on this crane guy. There we go. Now the crane guy. <laughs> he hadn't forgotten about me. He's just like totally expressionless on his face. This is kind of funny. Now we gotta fight. Okay, dodge. And then get into it. So it's the same old, same old with these fighting the big guys. Just follow the button prompts. And eventually, you get them. Okay. This one, I don't think that you can mash or anything here. You don't have to. But you just gotta wait for this animation and be ready to hit the circle to jump down on the horse. When the button prompt is right here. There we go. And the crane's gonna just knock him off. It's kinda cool. That was it for him. And cutscene. Hey. You alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine, but. Damn, I was sure they'd killed you, kid. Well, they tried, right? <laughs> so how the hell did you find me all the way out here? I had some help. Salim. <laughs> Solomon, thank you. We haven't much time. We cannot allow them to reach the city. Oh, I, I don't know. He's right, Nate. I've been trapped with those crazy bastards for days. I don't know what the hell it is Marlo's after exactly, but it sure as hell ain't treasure. We gotta stop them. Break, we must go, now. Bella! <laughs> Never a dull moment, huh, Sully? <laughs> Why change now? Yeah! Alrighty, off they go. They're gonna ride right into a sandstorm. And the sandstorm's gonna have another pretty, well, pretty tough fight, I think, for me. <laughs> hey, straight ahead! Into the storm? Are you sure you know what you're doing? Trust me, Drake! Trust me! Kind of mysterious because once um, once Nate and Sully get get stranded here, it's kind of the last we ever see of the of the local guys. Sully, Sully, stay close. Where's Celine? Must have lost him. Let's 
know something we don't. Okay, here's the fight. And, uh, who this one's tricky. I gotta first just follow Sully up here. I can see his outline. Hang back, Sully. I'll go check it out. Okay. And there should be a couple of guys here walking that I can see. I'm not gonna stealth them. I'm gonna try to grab this guy first. Because he's got a nice sniper rifle. Okay, like that. Pick up his T bolt. Okay. Now I think my friends are gonna be there, right? Okay, this part's a little tricky. Let's see what I can do with this. Okay, so my basic strategy is I'm gonna try to take someone out over here with the uh, with the sniper, and then see if I can get them to follow me over here. Okay, here they go, here they go. They've been conferencing. I would like to grab the red-headed guy because he uh, he's really fast. Or what about this dude here? Okay. Now I'm gonna head over here. They know to look, I'm gonna make a wide circle. Way out here where Sully can see me again. Oh, the red-headed guy didn't get him, I got him there. Okay, so Sully's doing some work for me now, here. Okay, there's going to be a really strong guy eventually to come and try and hunt me out here. There he is, right here. Okay. Once I grab him, I can pick up his weapon, because he's got a lovely uh, PAK-80. And this is like your heavy weapon. This can take some people out. Let's see what I can do here. Trying to keep a nice distance here so they don't just destroy me and slowly work my way in here. I can still see him back there running around. It helps to have Sully on this one. Whoa. There's a guy standing there. What's up with that? Is that guy dead? Oh god, he's just like leaning there. That's, that's creepy. Yeah, this this gun is pretty strong. It just like it's a machine gun, you can really let it let it uh, fire. But also, um, you know, each round is pretty powerful, so you don't need a lot. The disadvantage is Nate moves super slow with it. I'm gonna grab uh, grenades. Okay, I'm gonna go around the back here because I think there's another guy waiting for me that's gonna surprise me if I'm not careful. Let's see what I can do with this. Oh, there he is. Come on out. Yeah, just a couple of shots there. Just takes him down. You don't even really have to hit him in the head. You can get him. Okay, somebody's hiding behind that. Okay, he's just putting his little arm out. <laughs> Let's see what we can do here next. Yeah, so he's like, can't be the whole convoy. Oh, shoot, I had that guy there. Okay, got him there. Try to pick some of these guys off in here before I go past this wall. Because once you get past the wall, it's... uh. It's dicey. Okay, there's a dude down there. Let's see. Okay, now I'm kind of in. I really got to watch my, my back in here. Okay. I'm going to work my way over to the left side. There's going to be a guy up here that drops in. It's a pain. Ooh, there's a dude. Oh, I didn't kill him. Shoot. That's a problem. Okay, watch out for these... Uh, yeah, he wants me to get an RPG. Where is that? That's far enough away. It's not going to hurt me. Okay, you can see these snipers around me, too. Try to take some of them out real quick. Okay, while I have this gun available. There's a guy on top. Yeah, Sully keeps complaining about... He's hitting that guy up there. He's trying to, anyway. Let's see if I can do anything with this guy. Okay, there's that guy. Okay, that's cool. Okay, so the next thing is I need to get an RPG... Because there are these trucks over here that are shooting at me. Ooh, there's a nice dude right there. Okay, I'll take him. Oh dear, they're shooting at me from all the way over there. Okay. Yeah, those uh those trucks are no fun. So I'm gonna climb up on this thing if I can. Let's see if I can grab an RPG up here. And then get into cover. And try to take out a truck. Okay. 
That's not good. Is there a guy still up there? Let's see. I'm going to grab my gun again. Okay, just take my time on this one. Just trying to uh, slowly work my way through here. Here's a dude right here. He didn't see that coming. I guess it just knocked him off the other side. Okay. Did I steal his gun? Did I get that RPG? I don't know if I did. Ooh, so somebody's shooting at me from over here. Okay. All right, let's see what's around here. Let's see. So there's another RPG over there, and there's another... Um, there's another uh, tower um, with the RPG on it. There's three guys total, I think. Oh, there's a friend. Yeah, this guy's not super tough, but now I'm almost out of ammo with this PAK gun, so I'm gonna have to grab grab something better here. Okay, and that's fine because at least now I'm I'm fast again. Ooh, there's a lot of them here. Okay, let's see. I'll grab that micro because that's a nice weapon to have here. Right, corner, there's gonna be some guys around here. There should be anyway, let's see. Okay, I can see people. The thing is, I don't think they can see me until I fire at them first. And so, uh, I'll just be strategic about that and try to use this RPG against the, uh, the turret weapon real quick. Let's see if I can do that. Okay, there he is right there. He can see me no matter what. I don't know if that got him. I think it did. Okay, go down here again. Oh, crud. This is a strong guy. Follow me back here. Okay, I don't want his... Well, I guess I'll take it. That's fine. Okay. So Sully's helping me out. He's all over there. Okay. Let's see. Get out of there. Ooh, there's a dude right there that's going to try to mess me up. Serious, come on, get out of there. Yeah, whenever they have those uh, those micros and they train those on you, those are tough. That's like uh, a running theme in this game. Okay, blew himself up, that's fine. All right, so what else can I do? What else can I do? Kind of, kind of take it slow here. I can see a laser sight up there at the top that I need to be careful about. There still should be another turret weapon, I believe. Um, or maybe not. Maybe we got them all. I somehow don't think we did, though. If we did get them all, that's, like, super lucky. Who's over here? All right, just kind of slowly work our way over here. So the visibility gets a little better. Okay, he's doing his crummy shooting where he shoots out of the corner. Ooh, now he's hitting me there. Okay. Some ammo here. What's going on? Yeah, you can zoom in a little bit. Oh, there he goes. If you hit, uh, if you hit the R3, you can zoom in. Now there's some, uh, Tau Sniper people over here, and I'll try to take them out with a grenade if I can do that. Let's see. I don't know if that did anything, so I gotta real, be real careful in advance a little bit here. Can I kind of zigzag my way across and see if I can find anybody over here to get into it with? Okay, I can see somebody there. You can see me too, I think. Get down, get down. Here we go again. Now, let's see. I don't know. I, uh, I can't get anywhere near over there. I need to. Okay, let's go over this way. Careful, careful, get down. Yeah, you don't want to get sniped. <laughs> to say the least. There's a couple of other dudes. One, for example, right here. Ooh, man. Okay, I got him. Another dude here. It's really hard for me to see him. Okay, he blew himself up. This dude. <laughs> I made it easy for me. I'll take that. I think that's all of them. I think that's all of them. I hope so, man. Um, I See, I'm not sure what gun to pick. Because I'm not super familiar with the next chapter. I mean, these Tau snipers can help a lot, but I think they give me some in the next chapter anyway. So I guess I'm just going to... Uh, let's see, I got 65 and 58. I guess I'll just stick with what I have. 
I mean, I could look around real quick and see if I can grab something. That was the, the, the G model. I don't know. Uh, okay, I can grab some. The G model is the one where, where you have a sight on it, like a little bit of sight. Um, but you only fire three shots at a time is the, <clears throat> is the disadvantage on that one. Uh, maybe a grenade, something? I don't know. Got anything around here. Okay, so that was actually kind of a tricky scene right there, in my personal opinion. For me, it's tricky. I can, I can die pretty easy on that one if I'm not, if I'm not taking it slow. Yeah, they want, they want you to have those Tau Snipers. And Tau Sniper, um, those are pretty cool. Those are, those are pretty helpful, but they only, I think, carry six rounds. And so I'm just going to stay with what I have for now. Okay, so, yeah, we're going to head into the building. And this part's just uh, supposed to be really impressive. Like, it's this big space in here. It's pretty cool looking. Um, and there's a little treasure that I can grab. I saw this thing here. Let's see what we got here. This is... Yeah, it's another one. It's, it's another one of them creepy heads. Holy shit! <laughs> Look at this place. So it really does exist. It's amazing. Yeah, so those those doors are the entrance to the to the uh, Atlantis of the Sands, but we got to open them first. And so uh, here's a ladder here, and the ladder on that side, notice it's broken. So our only option is to go up this one here. Oh, hey. Managed to swipe your notebook back off Marlow. Figured it might come in handy. Still got it. Okay, now you just gotta hold Somebody down the plunger. Hold down the plunger and uh, you can see that it it's trying to open up one of these doors, but you gotta do them both at the same time. And so Sully's gonna have to help me out. Nate, come on, Sully. There's one on the other side. Yep, yep, yep. And you I'll can go see, see if it. I can get that one working. Okay. So a little bit of climbing. I'm gonna try to get on one of these things here. Let's see what I can do. Okay, and he's Nate's gonna have to Wait here. jump basically to that ledge and work his way over there. Uh, there's like a treasure underneath that platform if you want to go grab it, but you know, you know, it's like right underneath me. So, it, so if you jump at a lower point, you can go get it. Okay, now jump onto this platform down there, Two, like that. And let's see, can you see the little? Yeah, the treasure's down there. The treasure's down there. You can see it, but. I don't want that thing. I'd rather just do my mission, so we're just gonna keep going here. Now you got to uh, get on the stones here and climb across to this beam. And then you can go up. Gonna do a little more chandelier jumping. Here we go, can I make it? Almost There There he goes, okay, nice, nice, nice. And then he's gonna wanna go on this chandelier back here. Can I make it? Ooh, yeah, I'm always afraid he's gonna miss. <laughs> and then last one, uh, he can go across to the <gasps> other switch over on this side. You ready? Here Hit the go. plunger. There we go. And lo and behold, it opens up the doors. There we go. That's a pretty cool view. Alrighty, so now you just gotta get um, Sullivan. I'll be go to hell. You just gotta get back down uh, to the floor level, and uh, you can see that ladder over there. Uh, the the door is like the the um kind of the narrow part of the door is just a big ladder that Nate can climb down on. So I'll try to jump over there and hopefully not miss it and die. Alrighty, and this is a cool shot because you can just climb slowly and kind of take in the the view here. It's pretty cool. I got that sand cloud in the background. Somehow it's not like coming over the city. And then you can see all the crazy stuff there. And that's the end of the chapter, basically, right there. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, we're going to pick this up in the next chapter, The Atlantis of the Sands. I look forward to seeing you then. My name is Buzzin1 once again. And uh, yeah, thank you, and I'll see you next time.